Hey everyone, welcome to my part two video of Tour Bus Tour. I'm super excited to show you what we have on our tour bus as we tour this nation on a national tour. Here we go. This is the cast bus plus our awesome team leader, Gina. And this is our second one that houses all the crew. We just have two buses that travel the nation with us. Pressed in the code and now it's time to see the inside. So this is where our driver Wayne drives. This chair, sometimes you can chill with him, talk to him when he drives. We put the curtain up so he can focus. This chair, we put our name tags. So whenever we get off the bus, we put it there so we know that someone is not on the bus and we don't leave someone behind. And this is our front lounge, woohoo! So the really cool thing about this particular bus and Becky and Genevieve is this part is expandable. So this wall comes in. When we are parked in venues where we can expand our tour bus, we do so, but sometimes we can't and we gotta bring it all the way in, especially when we drive. And we got two sort of couches and a half couch and a table and a lovely purifier thingy. So this is our mini kitchen. We have a full size refrigerator at the top. We have all the things in the refrigerator. Our freezer, and we lock that so when we drive, this doesn't open up and everything comes crashing down. And this is a kitchen and a Becky and a Genevieve. So cute. We got a microwave. My favorite part about this kitchen area is this company provides us with snacks. So we got lots of snacks there. All these knobs go in, so that means it's locked so this won't open and everything won't come crashing down when we're driving. The snacks, all provided by the company. Very grateful, very, very grateful for that. And these come out. We definitely need more snacks, but this is pretty lit at the moment and the secret stash of candy. I think my favorite part about this whole thing is the trash can. It goes into a place that we will never see and our lovely driver takes out the trash. And since I showed you the kitchen, hi friends, I'm going to show you the bathroom. So fancy. Silent doors, no solid waste. Yes, you heard that right. That means toilet paper. Number two, if you gotta go number two, you can hold it. You can ask Wayne if it's possible to pull over to a gas station to do your business, or you may have to hot bag it. When times get tough, you have to do what you gotta do. This is not just a mirror, folks. This is where we sleep. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven bunks. We all get a bunk of our own. And then we make sure to always close these doors when someone is sleeping. Shh. And this is our back lounge. We have a TV. We got more places to eat, play video games more couches. It is super, super cool down here, over here, up here, wherever we are. Probably more storage, I've never gone in there. And that is the bus. Other than the bunks, which are people's personal places, I will show you mine. This is my bunk. So you open this up when you're not in it, and close it when you want to sleep. Who's that? It's Bernie! Bernie, what is your favorite thing about the bus? I really like the automatic doors. Me that too. Energy. Yes, and it's super silent, so we don't have to wake anyone up. I told them it's the trash can. That's mine. Can. Just <laughs> Thanks, sort of Bernie. goes off to the abyss. Yes, we never know. And it's not too smelly. In our front lounge, we have TVs and Bernie in the reflection. <laughs> and then another TV. We are spoiled. We also have an ice box, which we fill with ice and drinks. Currently, there's no ice but sometimes there is, and it's an automatic button that closes and opens the drawer. It's super cool. Where do we put our suitcases, you may ask? Well, you can either put them in the back lounge right before you sleep, but for the bigger suitcases and the things that are not your day bags, we put them in the bay. Isn't that cool? You just close this little thing.